Hi friends, today I will teach the topic how to configure static VLAN. In static VLAN, we can create different networks based upon the switch ports. Here we can see 2960 Cisco Catalyst switch can be used. Here first 5 ports can be assigned to network 1 and next 5 ports can be assigned to network 2. Let's we can see the IP address 200.200.200.0 in local area network we can assign the subnet mask 26 26 can be mentioned as 255.255.255.192 .252 can be calculated as 128 plus 64 so last value we can add it as 64 so each local area network we can assign 64 IP address in 64 IP address we can assign only 62 IP address to the host remaining 2 IP address can be used for direct broadcast and net ID here we can create 2 local area network I will assign the net ID is 0 and 64 now we can configure this switch Okay, in default, all Cisco Cisco Catalyst switch have one VLAN one thousand two thousand three thousand four and thousand five. These five VLANs are predefined VLANs, so these five VLANs can be predefined in all Cisco Catalyst switch. Maximum VLANs we can create is thousand five. In that, we cannot create five VLANs. Remaining thousand VLANs we can be create. Now we can create the VLAN, go to the global mode, configure terminal, in short form we can give config t, ok, VLAN, VLAN, VLAN ID, here we can see the VLAN ID can be created as 1 to 1005, here 1, 1002, 1003, 1004 and 1005 are predefined VLANs, so we cannot create that VLANs, so remaining VLAN we can be create, here I will give 10 next I will give the name of that VLAN name I will give CSC exit VLAN 20 because I will create two different networks so for that purpose only I will create VLAN 10 for one network and VLAN 20 for another network the name of the VLAN 20 is IT exit now we can see the way VLAN go to the privilege mode and give show space VLAN here we can see 10 and 20 the 10 name of the VLAN 10 is CSC and name of the VLAN 20 is IT department so in default all this is go uh, in default all switch all fast ethernet ports and gigabyte ethernet ports are in VLAN 1 that is native VLAN so now we can assign first 5 ports to VLAN 10 that is CEC department and next 5 ports can be assigned to VLAN 20 that is IT department. Okay, The switch can be connected to the PC that ports can be assigned as an access port. So now we can assign that ports as an access port configure terminal. So first 5 ports can be assigned uh, first 5 ports can be assign as an access port and that ports can be assigned to the VLAN 10 that name as CAC department so e o each time we can give interface fast ethernet 0 slash 1 interface fast ethernet 0 slash 2 so instead of that we can give interface in short form we can give int and here I will give range range means if you are go if you are selecting two or more interface means we can give range so here I will give fast ethernet 0 slash 1 to 5 so it will select fast ethernet 0 slash 1 to 5 now that port can be assigned to access port the syntax for assigning that port as an access port is switch port mode axis ok now the ports can be assigned to the access port next we can that ports can be assigned to the VLAN 10 switch port mode axis VLAN sorry switch port 
axis VLAN 10 now that 5 ports can be assigned to the VLAN 10 that is network 1 the name of the VLAN 10 is CSE department the syntax for assigning that ports to that VLAN 10 is switch port axis VLAN 10 exit again interface range fast ethernet 0 slash 6 to 10 so these 5 ports can be assigned to the VLAN 20 that is network 2 so first of all the ports can be assigned as an axis port switch port mode axis now that ports can be assigned to the VLAN 20 that is network 2 switch port axis VLAN 20 exit now we can see that configuration show VLAN here we can see first 5 ports can be assigned as axis port and that 5 ports can be assigned to network 1 that is VLAN 10 named as CEC department next 5 ports can be assigned as an axis port that ports can be assigned to the network 2 named as IT department now 2 networks can be created in this switch first 5 ports can be assigned to network 1 that is VLAN 10 named as CEC department and next 5 ports can be assigned to VLAN 20 named as CEC uh, sorry IT department now we can assign the IP address to each network so I will assign 200.200.200.1 sorry 2 1 can be assigned as a default gateway so subnet mask is 192 200.200.200.1 in second IP I will assign 200.200.200.3 subnet mask is 192 default gateway is 200.200.200.1 here assign 200.200.200.4 subnet mask is 192 default gateway is 200.200.200.1 200.200.200.5 subnet mask is 192 default gateway is 200.200.200.1 Here I will assign 200.200.200.6 Subnet mask is 192 Default gateway is 200.200.200.1